everyone and welcome to mc 4 TV. I'm Judith, the Youth Enterprise Champion, and I'm with Stacey Appleyard of Stacey Jane Crafts. Thank you for joining us, Stacey. I'm really looking forward to hearing about your journey to becoming your own boss. But first, how have you been keeping during the pandemic? Um, so I actually set up my business in the pandemic. Um, so I haven't seen like a massive growth or anything like that. I've just been basically just like plodding along, figuring out um, how to run a business properly. Um, I have had some orders, but not like anything massive. I'm happy you're still staying, staying safe. Um, tell us a little bit more about your business. Um, so my business is like making and selling crochet products. Um, I do like a variety of products, so like scrunchies, keyring, blanket, um, and I also like if someone has a request, I can try and like work with them and make a product that they want as well. It's nice that you can personalize um, things for people, for your customers. I think uh, it's a very niche market or small market that you're in. Not many people make uh, crochet products. What made you get into making crochet items? Um, so I have actually always been interested in like stuff to do with like yarn. So my partner's mum actually does knitting and I did try knitting but I just couldn't do it at all um but I have always been interested in crochet like I used to watch uh YouTube videos and I was just really interested in. and then I was actually shopping and they had like a lot of crochet equipment so like the hooks the yarn and I was like you know what I'm gonna buy it see how it goes and basically teach me teach myself how to crochet and just went from there Brilliant. Oh, wonderful how you taught yourself uh, to do it all. And, and you you do you make some really great things. I really like the scrunchies. They look so unique, you know, the mix of colours and everything. What's your favourite product to make so far? Because you made quite you make quite a variety of products. Um I'd say the scrunchie or the little heart earrings. Those are my favorite because um like I can do them quite quickly, but with the scrunchies um like working with different types of yarn like so it's like different sizes and like different textures for your hair nice so you get to experiment with different um, yarns with those products that's brilliant and i know sissy you're not only an entrepreneur but you're also a mom so how do you manage to juggle running your business as well as being a busy mom um it was really hard to begin with like I'd only have enough time when he was like take a nap or like when he's actually in bed but now he's started full-time school and um, so I, I've got a lot more time on my hands oh that's good well that's that makes sense you know with kids that's the beauty of kids they grow up and you know soon they'll, they'll start leaving you so <laughs> that's good what are some of the challenges you faced as a self-employed person? Just like figuring it all out really on my own. Um, I have had support, but it was like trying to adapt to something new. Yeah, no, it's true. You mentioned you got some support. How did um, MC4C support you? So MC4C have been brilliant like throughout. Um, so I stand up with them and like at the start you have to do this big 13 and um, which is basically like skills for for wear um, and once I completed that like I was doing like business zooms alongside it so the support you like throughout from start to finish. Oh, I'm glad you got um, some support from MC4C. What about the John Cracknell Youth Enterprise Bank? What kind of support did you get from them and how did it help you? Um, so I actually got two, yeah, I think it was two grants um, over a period of time from the John Cracknell Youth Bank. And that helped me a lot to like basically get what I needed so I could get like branding, I could get 
um, like more materials to make things. And I actually got um, some knitting machines. So it was kind of like, not easier, but quicker to make like hats and things in the future. Nice. I'm glad you've got quite um, the, the financial support from the youth bank and it was able to get you a few of the things that you needed. Um, what would you say are some of the benefits or the rewards of being your own boss? Um, I'd say like basically freedom is like the main thing. So like you can choose what hours to work, you can like basically it's yours so you don't have someone telling you what to do every day you can do something different every day i think that's one of the best things uh, as to even myself i want why i want to become my own boss the freedom um to work your own hours and, and being really your own boss <laughs> so brilliant um would you recommend mc4c to a friend yeah absolutely like yeah actually amazing i'm glad you are you you feel that way now i've tried crochet uh, in the past and knitting and i've enjoyed it i have knitted and i did crochet a scarf something very simple so <laughs> i know you're very talented having taught yourself you know to make such a wide range of products you know blankets and like, as you mentioned earlier clothing earrings you know it's quite a, a, a range you've got there so what's coming up for stacy jane crafts you know anything exciting coming up soon um something new and very exciting in my opinion is coming up so i want to open my own online store so I have been researching through Shopify and I want to like have my own store so people can like order through that and then the option for like bespoke products as well for the larger products they'd have to message me but the store that can like order what I've already got in stock. Brilliant I'm I'm looking forward to seeing that you know f uh, come to to fruition and I'm sure you'll do great you know you are definitely an inspiration to many young people and, and I'm sure a lot of young young entrepreneurs you know look up to what you're doing and you're doing a great job um Stacey it's been lovely talking to you today um make sure uh, to follow Stacey on her social media pages at Stacey Jane Crafts and Stacey, I wish you all the best with your business. And I really appreciate you being with us today. Thank you. If you are a young person who has a great business idea or you have a hobby you would like to turn into a business, then get in touch with MC Fossey today. Just like Stacey, we could help you develop your business idea and help you become your own boss. Thank you.